Right, that is uh, the beautiful voice and the music of uh, Nina Freelon. And uh, she's one of the stars of this year's Standard Bank Joy of Jazz, uh, celebrating 20 years of bringing international and local artists together on various stages over a few days. And uh, she's one of the uh, great acts that you'll be able to enjoy. And this is her second time, actually. And just to tell you a little bit about her, six-time Grammy Award winner and uh, a Grammy Award nominee, uh, but has won a number of accolades over her uh, distinguished career and has sang alongside uh, Lumerie, such as Ray Charles, uh, Ellis Marsalis, and the late Al Jerome George Benson. Let's uh, chat to her now and see what we can expect at this year's Joy of Jazz from Nina Freelon. Thank you very much for joining us and welcome back to South Africa. Thank you very much. It's so lovely to be here. Are you excited to be uh, doing Standard Bank Joy of Jazz again? I am. It's a fabulous festival. Um, and one of the best parts is meeting new people that you didn't know before. Right. Yes. So, um, you know, reading up about you, uh, you were, I suppose, relatively late to get to the stage. <laughs> and, I just, and I just wonder, did the stage find you or was it something you always wanted to do? This is something that I had to do. You know, you know sometimes you get a calling. And so it, it's, um, it's a blessing to be able to do what you love and to travel the world doing it. So I, I feel really grateful. I mentioned uh, Ellis Marsalis and uh, we met his uh, son just now. He, was, he played a role in how your career took off, didn't he? Absolutely. Ellis was a great, is still a great mentor, uh, a great friend, someone who supported me from the very beginning. And you know, you need, you need the support at the start, you know, before the world knows you. Um, and so the entire Marcellus family is just like jazz royalty. And uh, it's wonderful to have Ellis as, you know, that great support at the, at the beginning. Yes. So tell us about the space that you have created for yourself in the jazz world. What, what, what do you call that space? <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, it, it's interesting. When you've been doing something for a while, you tend to move in these circles. You tend to grow. Um, I, I feel like I'm a lifelong learner. And I'm still curious about what's next, about what's coming. And it's so amazing uh, in this festival to have international, local, regional uh, people all coming together. It's, it's really quite amazing and, and really what we should be about, you know. The music is um, uh, sort of playing a, a, a role in demonstrating how we should get along, how we should cooperate, how we should collaborate. It's beautiful. So you've traveled quite a bit and performed on many stages and I just wonder what your sense of uh, jazz on our continent uh, is like and how you feel about it and being involved with it. Very soulful, very rhythmic, um, complementary to the improvisational mindset but with, with a very distinct rhythm that's beautiful in particular to this place and it's wonderful. They say that a lot of the roots of jazz are uh, African and uh, part European. Do, do you feel that when you come back to the continent? Absolutely. Absolutely. That is the, as they say, God's honest truth. <laughs> <laughs> so what can people expect uh, from Nina Freeland? Well, um, tonight we're going to pull from a, a wide repertoire. Um, I like a lot of different kinds of music from Stevie Wonder 
to um, Duke Ellington, to Thelonious Monk. Um, tonight we're going to pull on the standards, but my idea of standard is to, is to express in a non-standard way. So you'll hear standards, but they won't be like you, they won't be like you think. They won't be like you think. All right, so there's a, a lot of young musicians that are watching this program now, and they want to be Nina Freelon. <laughs> and you've got a big fan base here. I don't know if you knew that. Yeah, I do because they hit me up on Facebook and they and Twitter, and so I get you know I'm like South Africa, really? <laughs> you want me to come back? Okay, I will. <laughs> so it's a tough road, but what advice would you give uh, young musicians and, and young vocalists that, that would like to emulate? You know, um, like I said before, this is a calling, and it's a lifelong calling for me. I mean, a lot of times people get frustrated because things don't happen in a timely fashion according to their time frame. But if you choose this, and if this chooses you, I mean, you're in it for a long haul. And you also have to um, be as creative off stage, making a way for you to do what you do as you are on stage. And I would say everybody deserves the life they want. Go for it. So you're living your life, that your dreams. <laughs> living my life. What would you say have been some of the things that have stood out? And I know that is a difficult question because there's so many, but there must be some things you look back and you say, thank you God for that day. Yeah. Well, working with Al Jarreau was an amazing thing. And I miss him like crazy. I really do miss him. Um, but I, I, you know, I look at it like getting on a train so you get on the train at the beginning and you keep riding. So it's more about the journey than it is about any moment. You can always pick moments that have been fantastic. But the point is to stay on the train. Whether it's a good moment, fantastic, or a disappointing one, you're in for the long haul. And what chapters are still yet to be written? What's on the horizon? <laughs> I'm writing, I've, I've written a play. I'm pitching it now to Broadway. It's called The Clothesline Muse. Um, I'm enjoying my life as a, I don't know if you'd call me, you know, like, elder. Uh, I'm enjoying that. I'm enjoying the teaching part of it. I'm enjoying seeing these young, new, bright voices and instrumentalists come along. So it's a, this, is a good, this is a good time for this music. And this music is very necessary. It's equal opportunity music. And we need that now more than ever. Well, thank you very much indeed. And Thank you for coming back to South Africa and we look forward to watching you on the stage. Thank you. Thank you. So that was Nina Freelon and uh, distinguished career and uh, we, you heard the names that she's performed alongside but she's carved a career uh, of her own as well and uh, we certainly look forward to watching her at the Standard Bank Joy of Jazz which is taking place in uh, Santa north of Johannesburg. Your love is rain, my heart the flower, I need your love or I will die, my very life, life, life is in your power, will I wither and fade or bloom to the sky, aguaji baby. Give the flower water to drink. I got you, baby. Give the flower water to drink. 